get the world. fuck out of my office. <laughs> I mean, at this point in my career, I'm more like a general practitioner. I, I don't specialize in specific, um, gotcha. unique uh, masturbating habits. Gotcha. Okay, yeah. so here's Wait, a fun. You want to hear a fun game? Right. Yeah, let's do oh. it. Uh, so I asked people to write in questions, and then I would have you answer them. Yeah. And so uh, I cheated. I looked at some of them. But go ahead. Yeah. Well, instead of well, letting you answer them, because that's boring. I answered them for you, and then I want you to tell me how I did. <laughs> I like this. This is good. Yeah, okay. I'm on board. Let's do it. Okay. Yeah. All right. So we got, uh, uh, and most of them were DM'd to me. I think all the ones where they were like just replied to the message. I don't think I used any of those. But <laughs> yeah. Uh, this guy, uh, all these are anonymous, by the way. He said, okay. I, f- I feel very empty and extremely depressed, and jerking my pickle is the only source of dopamine in my life. This, yeah, his pickle. His gherkin. This mm. sounds like a joke, but I'm suffering. Please help me. And I responded okay. as a therapist. Mm-hmm. I said, if jacking off your penis is your sole source of pleasure, then maybe try going to a truck stop and jacking off many penises. This will <laughs> multiply the happiness. <laughs> Would you say that's good, right. good therapy? Yeah. No, no, probably not. No? No. no. It's Ooh. just math, dude. I just feel like... yeah. <laughs> <laughs> one penis equals good time. Twenty <laughs> penises equal rocket ship to the moon. Good time. Yeah, yeah. Right? I get the logic there. Um, I feel like you put yourself at risk when you go to a truck stop and just jerk off. You know, twenty. Well, you dudes. would bring a welder glove. I mean, like, yeah. dude. Well, and those guys have their own problems. They probably like being jerked off. Yeah, you probably think about the good. spread of mental health. Like you're really helping out those twenty guys plus yourself. So, okay, so it's like an altruistic act, you're saying. Yeah, yeah, and those yeah. guys' wives are going to benefit in the long run, too, because they can let off some steam at the trust <laughs> yeah. stop or whatever. <laughs> the boys will be boys. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I say every time I, I'm like whacking get, off 20 uh, guys at the truck stop. Yeah. Boys will be boys. Off, yeah. <laughs> well, mm. I can't help it. I'm a man. Yeah. <laughs> God. Uh, oh, man, I, let's see. Hold on. I got this one. Um. Oh, this one's pretty good. This guy asked, how to improve confidence when talking to girls? And uh, I answered, get drunk. if you're nervous when speaking to women, simply get close to them in other aspects of their life before verbal communication. <laughs> Watch them from outside their windows at night. <laughs> Collect hair, body waste, and clothing from their yeah. garbage and craft a doll, which you can then practice conversations with. <laughs> when you eventually muster the courage to talk to them, it'll be like speaking to an old friend. Oh, mm. that's good. That's yeah. good. I think that's right. good. I think I'm going to ask for his approval on this one. I think that one's a... I'm not, yeah. that, I knocked Check that one that out of the ballpark. Yeah, that one's Hit good. Hit on that one. It's... <laughs> oh, I already hit send. And I said, I wrote all of them. I said, I did the message and I said, uh, love uh, Don Tony. <laughs> Come on, man. You, Come on, man. Come on, man. Come on, man. Yeah. Um, and a picture of a Ford signature. <laughs> no, I did. I did immediately. This guy, the first guy asked me that question. And I responded with that answer about jacking off the guys. And he goes, I have a feeling you didn't ask Don Tony. <laughs> I yeah, said, no, you, I haven't even person. spoke to him yet. I haven't even. <laughs> thank you, not... random person for knowing better. I appreciate yeah. it. <laughs> yeah. 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 But that's my breakout into into um were those therapy. the only two questions? <laughs> no, I, that have you some, I have some more. Uh there's a guy that uh he was it's a it's a girl who caught her boyfriend talking to other women on Snapchat. Uh, and wait, she was what? asking whether or not she should work together and like try to fix the relationship or leave them. Mm-hmm. And then I su- I was like, I'm sitting there thinking about it, like mm-hmm. Yeah. The only reason why this is a bad thing is because of the environment that you're in, you know? So I, I suggested uh, that they all convert to Mormonism because Mormons believe in polygamy. Oh. And so mm-hmm. then it would just be, you know, they That's wouldn't like be breaking win, any win. rules at all. Ah, <laughs> you, yeah. you, she'd be change. happy and then he would, uh, you know, get to put his penis in other women and then he would be happy. Oh, it's a win-win-win. That's a win-win. Yeah. 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 That one's just science too. I don't think you can even. I don't know if you anything. can dispute the science, right? Yeah. yeah. Nope. Uh, that's pretty hook, line, and stinker on that one. So so far, it seems three for three. I think, I think so. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And this guy hasn't pretty... even been able to tell us. <laughs> he hasn't been able to write us a prescription for quaaludes or anything. Yeah. <laughs> this guy's fucking... How long has he been doing this? Goddamn legal weed.